Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have for you a must-do deals for Walgreens for next week, the 19th through the 25th. We have some really great deals on things like Tide, Dove, and Nexus. So those are awesome deals. So I'll have the deals in a Google Doc linked down below. But I also have towards the end of the video, I have some early activation scenarios if you're interested in that, and those will also be in the Google Doc for you down below. So the first thing I want to talk about are the coupon inserts that are coming out on Sunday the 19th. We're getting one insert, and that is the Smart Source insert. We're going to be getting coupons like Cetaphil and Irish Spring. So if you want to order those, I do have a link down below. It's to BQ Savings. You can preview all the coupons that are going to be in that week's insert. Um, and they also come within two to three days through FedEx. So the first deal I want to talk about is a deal that we get quite often, and it's on the Complete Home Baggies. They are usually every few weeks, and it's buy one, get two free, and they're $2.79 a piece. So you would buy three of them, and you would get uh, the other two for free, and they would equal out to about $0.93 cents a piece. But the reason why I don't say to sleep on these is because this is perfect filler items for using register rewards. So that's a little tip, a little hack for you guys, that when we have a week where we have the baggies, get three of them, and then you have items to attach your register rewards to. So for the next deal, it's one of the deals of the week where you buy three, you get back $5 in Walgreens cash. It includes items like Dove dry spray deodorant, Dove body wash, and bar soap. Um, it has Tresemme, Oral-B, and Pampers included as well. So we're going to get one of the women's dry spray deodorant and one of the men's dry spray deodorant. They are two for $13. Now in the past, they have been buy one, get one 50% off, and they never advertised it in the ad, so we don't know if that's going to be the case or not. If it is, it'll be a really, really good deal. And then we are also going to buy an Oral-B toothbrush for $3.00. So that will equal out to $16. Now, if you're doing this in store, you can use paper and digital coupons. So we have $1.50 off Dove digital coupon for the deodorant. We also have $1.50 off of one Dove men's insert coupon from the September Unilever insert. And then there's a $2 off Oral-B coupon from the September P&G that you can use. I still have one on an account that's a $2 off digital. So you can use either or. You'd pay $11 and get back $5 in Walgreens cash. Then submit your receipt to Fetch Rewards. You'll get back $2, 2,000 points for getting two dry spray deodorants. And then your final cost would be $4 for the three items or $1.33 a piece. And now another option that you can do for that type of scenario, or you can do it in all one scenario, um, is to buy two Tresemme at $5 a piece and then one of the Oral-B toothbrushes. That will equal out to $13. Then you'll use the four off two coupon from the September Unilever insert or a digital version of that. And then the same with the Oral-B, you can use the $2 coupon from the September P&G or a digital version of that. You'd pay $7, you get back $5 in Walgreens cash, making them $2 for three items or 66 cents a piece. And you can definitely use Walgreens cash on any of the combinations that you come up with for the buy three, get $5 back in Walgreens cash. But those are the two options that I come up with. There's a lot more that you can mix and match with. So the next deal I'll talk about is the Nexus. The Nexus is spend 20, get back $10 in Walgreens cash. So I would definitely put this in with a spend booster. I have a spend booster for next week that is another spend 55, get back $12 in Walgreens cash, which isn't as bad as it sounds. I actually had a lot of fun with my scenario this current week, so I'm definitely going to be adding the Nexus into that type of scenario. So then you're going to buy two of the Nexus finishing sprays if you're doing this in store. It'll be about $14.99. So the cost for two of them will be $29.98. You can use two $5 off one Nexus coupons from the September Unilever insert, pay $19.98, get back $10 in Walgreens cash, making them $4.99 a piece. Now if you do this online through curbside pickup, this finishing spray is $11.99, but you only can use one digital coupon. 
So that's always something to think about. I'm actually probably going to be getting three or four products and using a mixture of paper and digital because if you spend 40 you would get back $20 in Walgreens cash. So you can do deals like that and I've done it in the past and it's worked out really, really well. Next is a deal that everybody can do. You don't need coupons or anything like that. And it's on the airhead ropes that are for five ounces. And it's only the airhead ropes. They will be on sale for $1.49. You pay that in store. You can use Walgreens cash if you want to pay for that that way. Um, and then you'll get back a $1.49 register reward. But then you can submit your receipt to Ibotta and get back a dollar on the airheads. And the ropes are included. So then that would make these free and a dollar money maker. So the next deal is on some laundry and we haven't had Tide on sale for a few weeks. So this promotion, you buy three items, you get one for free. There's no rewards back, but they will be on sale for $4.49 a piece. I personally would get Tide as the items that I buy and then get the Downy or the Bounce as the free item. So it includes Tide, Downy, Bounce, and then like the Downy scent beads. The reason why I say to get the Tide as your buying items is because the coupons that we got this month in the Tide P&G for softeners is only a dollar for the smaller sizes and two dollars for the bigger sizes. Typically we get two dollars so I would go with Tide Pods and then for my free item I chose the Downy Liquid. You want to use a two dollar Tide Liquid coupon from the September P&G and a two dollar Tide Pod from the September P&G. And then if we get a digital you would want to use a digital for the third item or an internet printable from pggoodeveryday.com. That would bring your total down to $7.47 for four of them or $1.87 a piece. So next I'm gonna throw at you a few early activation scenarios. That way you're ready on Saturday night if you want to participate in early activation. So I'm gonna talk about a few little rules with early activation. Number one, they cannot be done on monthly deals. So last month we did a bunch of Colgate, but this month Colgate was considered a monthly deal, so we weren't able to do it on the Colgate at all. You can still do early activation, even if your store isn't open late or 24 hours. My stores are not, and I do curbside pickup Saturday night, and I pick them up on Sunday anytime or even on Monday, and I still get my double dipping of both weeks. And the only downside about this is that it's very, your miles may vary. And that means what works at one store may not work at another store. Some stores do not participate in early activation. And I don't know why it's not all of them. I really wish I could give you that answer. So it really is just something that you will have to try out to see if it works. Now, typically early activation starts around 11 p.m., I go live and we kind of just wait together when the early activation starts and then we say, okay, this is what I'm getting, this is what I'm getting back, this is what's working, this is what isn't working. Um, and you kind of speculate what the deals for the previous week or for the following week will be and what match with the previous week. So it's really fun to do and I've really had a lot of good luck with it. I want to reiterate that the time is around 11 p.m. Eastern Time. So if you live on the West Coast, then it would be, you know, 8 p.m. your time. And you can do these in store or as curbside pickups. But it's not going to be every deal that matches up. So I will try to include these in videos from now on and you can see what kind of deals will work and what won't. So the first deal I have for the Nexus, and this was a deal that I did the first time I did early activation, was on the Nexus. This current week, the 12th through the 18th, the Nexus and the refresh items are spend 20, get back $10 in Walgreens cash. Next week, it's the same thing. They're spend 20, get back $10 in Walgreens cash, and it's not a monthly deal. So you're going to buy two Nexus finishing sprays at $11.99 because we're doing this strictly online. We're gonna use that $5 off digital coupon and we are going to pay $18.98. We'll get back $20 in Walgreens cash because we'll be double dipping. That will make those two sprays free and a dollar and two cent moneymaker. 
Now you cannot pay with Walgreens cash, but I am going to show you an example at the very end of the video on the scenario that I'm going to do where there's spend deals and I am using Walgreens cash in case you want to mimic that. So if you're just doing this by itself, no, you cannot use Walgreens cash. So next is Tresemme. Tresemme is included in a promotion this week where you spend 30, you get back $10 in Walgreens cash from the 12th to the 18th. Next week, from the 19th to the 25th, it's part of a promotion where you buy three, you get back $5 in Walgreens cash. So, in order for this to double dip, we're going to need to get $30 worth of Tresemme. So that's six Tresemme's shampoo and conditioner. We have a four off two digital coupon. So you would pay $26 and get back $20 in Walgreens cash, and that would make them $6 for six of them or a dollar a piece. Now the reason why you're getting back 20 is because you're getting 10 from the previous week and 10 for the new week because you're getting six and you're hitting that buy three, get $5 in Walgreens cash twice. So if you love Tresemme, this is definitely a deal for you. Um, these are the only, the next deal that I show you and the ones that I've talked about are the only ones that I see from the ad that would early activate. But I find, if I find out any more, I can put them on the community tab to show you any more that I might hear about. So the last scenario I'm going to talk about is the spend 30, get back $10 in Walgreens cash. Another way that you can do this if you don't want to use Tresemme or get Tresemme. So the next week, they're buy three, get five from the 19th through the 25th. And we're going to get Dove items. The Dove men's bar soap is buy one, get one 50% off this week. So we're going to get the sale price for this week. So you want to grab two of the men's bar soap or men's body wash at $8.59 and $4.29. Then you're going to pick up two of the women's body wash, one for $7.99 and one for $3.99. Then you're going to pick up a Dove women's deodorant, one of the solid kinds, for $7.29. And then you're going to pick up a men's deodorant, the solid kind, for, uh, excuse me, for $3.64. So that's going to bring our total up to $35.79. We're going to use digital coupons, of course. We're going to use the $2 off Dove Men's Body Wash Digital. I have on my account two $1 off Dove Body Wash Digitals. I have $1.50 off of one Dove Deodorant Digital. And then I have a $0.50 cents off of Dove Men's Deodorant Digital. That's going to bring my total down to $29.79. I'll get back $20 in Walgreens cash, making the total for those six items $9.79 or $1.63 a piece. Now, I'm going to show you a scenario next that I will be doing on Saturday night on the live, and I will be getting the Nexus and these Dove items, and I will be using Walgreens cash. So I'm going to show you that here in just a second. But I think this is a really good deal to do if you really like Dove products. And you will be getting six Dove products for under $10. Considering that the Dove bar, Men Bar Soap that I got in store this week for one package was $8.79. So I think it's a really good deal. Okay, so here is the scenario that I plan on doing. Now, this scenario is going to help lower my out-of-pocket, but it's not going to change the price of what the actual cost of these items will be. But I do have a spend 20, get back $5 in Walgreens cash booster. I will be able to get an extra $5 in Walgreens cash back because I am placing my order on Saturday night. So I'm going to get all of the Dove items, and then I'm going to get two... Nexus finishing sprays or shampoos. I can't decide which one I'll get, but it'll be an $11.99 item. I will use the $2 off men's body wash or bar soap digital coupon. I'll be using my $2 off Dove body wash coupons, my $1.50 off of one Dove deodorant digital coupon. And I don't know what happened to the 50 cent one in there, but it, I will have the 50 cent one on the Google Doc. Then the $5 off Nexus Digital Coupon. That will bring my total down to $47.77. I will get back $45 in Walgreens cash. I'll be getting $20 for the Nexus, and I'll be getting $20 for the Dove, plus $5 for the Booster. 
but I'm going to be using $20 in Walgreens cash to lower my out of pocket. I'll still get back that $45. Now my total for everything will be $2.77 for eight items or 35 cents a piece. Now, how am I able to use Walgreens cash? Well, it's actually quite simple. The Walgreens system wants you to spend cash in order to get back the Walgreens cash. So, in their system, they count coupons as cash. So if I use $11 in coupons, which I will be using in this scenario, I only have to pay $9 out of my own pocket. So for example, we're going to get $42 worth of items, not on this transaction, just an example. We're going to get $42 worth of items, and we're going to use $20 in Walgreens cash. That's going to bring our total down to $22. Then we have $11 in coupons, and then our total is going to be $11. You pay that $11, you're still going to get back all of your rewards, and you're not paying a ton of money out of pocket to save money. So that's what I'm doing here. I am using $20 in cash rewards. That way my out of pocket isn't as high. Now, I don't have $50 in Walgreens cash on this account. Otherwise, I would bulk up my transaction a little bit more. So that is really all I have for early activation. If I find out more things that could possibly double dip, I will put them in the community tab. If I don't put anything up there, then that is all I have found out is what I have in this video. Like I said, there is also a Google Doc with all of this information down below for you, as well as regular spend 20 get back five dollars in Walgreens cash scenario that I wasn't able to fit into this video otherwise this video would be a lot longer so anyways guys that is all I have for you today I hope this video was helpful and I hope you guys have a great day so thank you so much for watching bye guys